Now this is Arnica. Now Arnica montana is a species that grows, people grow a lot in gardens, the one that you see a lot um, in the stores and all, if you're buying it in bulk or in remedies. This is a native Arnica to the northwest called meadow Arnica and it's a, may look a little different, but basically it's, it's still Arnica, used for the same reasons. We have um, these yellow, see the yellow ray flowers and the Asteraceae and more flowers there. And it's opposite branching and whole leaves, hairy stem. Okay, and some things you should know about. Well, I always think of this as the first, first aid or um, bumps, bruises, sprains. And a lot of times people take this um, homeopathically, and it's a good idea to have that for bumps and bruises and sprains as a homeopathic in your first aid kit. And you can also um, make an oil, a salve. You can make a wash with this or use the flowers direct um, as well. But externally, so even if you make a tincture and you use it, you can make a tincture and use it externally as well. Um, so it promotes the healing of wounds contracted through blows and punctures and falls and cuts and it's uh, anti-inflammatory, antiseptic, relieves pain from injuries, promotes tissue regeneration. Um, you can clean wounds, abscesses, boils and ulcers with diluted tincture and dress them with a compress soaked in the same solution. And for contusions, sprains, bruises, arthritis, inflammation of the lymphatic vessels, you can apply packs of the diluted arnica tincture. It can relieve headaches, visual disturbances due to concussions. You can apply these kinds of compresses to the head and neck, once again, with diluted tincture. Um, to prepare the packs and wash, just dilute a tablespoon of the arnica tincture in a cup of boiled water. And um, once again, just use that externally. So it is a perennial great one to grow in the garden, but if you're lucky enough to live in a place where it grows in the wild, take a hike up to where it grows and where, where I'm at, it's in the subalpine area, and I go up and, and often take my, 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 my alcohol and my oil and my jars up the mountains because I can make the freshest medicine and put the flowers right in the jar and make it right up there, take it all in my backpack, take a day trip up and go doing a little wild crafting adventure. So once again, Arnica is just a great first aid um, plant to get to know and use.